Hey guys, this is Gabriel Roberts of Roberts Bushcraft. Today I'm doing a quick review on Zero Core's portable power station as well as their 40 watt solar panel. So here's the 40 watt solar panel in its carry case. You can see you've got a handle up top, two buckles, and a zip pouch on the front. Now inside of this zipper pouch you'll find a few uh, very important items uh, just to this kit. Got some adapter pieces here. And the neat thing, they're all sized to fit this one main cord. Not only is this cord used to charge uh, or to bring a charge from the solar panel to the battery pack, but it can also be used for output uh, from the battery pack to whatever device you need it to charge. Now I'll give you some information on the inside here. This on the side is a solar voltage controller. Pretty much what that does is controls the amount of uh, voltage coming through into this battery pack and it's pretty much just used for optimal uh, efficiency with this solar panel. This thing has a AC adapter on the side. Well not an adapter, just a port on the side here. And how you activate that is by cutting AC power on. Now you'll notice have a green light there and that simply lets you know hey you've got AC power on now you can use this outlet. Uh, what we've got here something that's been instrumental in the cabin build has been a drill. Something like that can simply be plugged up. And now you've got power going to this charge uh, charger for the drill battery. Now I'm going to walk you guys through that a little more here in a second, but I just wanted to show that right off the bat that you can use normal household appliances out here all because of this outlet on the top. And that to me is golden. I absolutely love that they included that. Uh, in my opinion, that makes it all worth it. You'll see right here on the side, you've got uh, two USB ports, 12 volt output, 15 volt input. I'm going to show you how to charge this using the solar panel. So one end of this cord that came with the solar panel will go into this input. Now you'll see right auto automatically, see right now, oh it's going to be hard to see, we're at 98%. It's got a digital display up top. Utilizing the solar voltage controller here, you simply plug this in. And there's no way to mess this up. There's only one port. That goes right in. Now we're down here on ground level and you can see I've just got this solar panel leaning against a piece of pine. But let's say you're in a position where you don't have anything you can lean it up against. Uh, let's say the sun is either just rising or beginning to set. You need it at an angle. They were smart enough to include built-in kickstands. They simply pop up and there's two. So you have one on each side. And by utilizing these kickstands, either creating a greater angle or a lesser angle closer to the panel, you can raise the panel up or lower it down. So another quick thing I wanted to point out to you, you'll notice here on this controller, the blue light is shining. That simply lets you know that the solar panel is receiving a charge and it's distributing that charge. So at this point, the battery bank is receiving a charge. I forgot to show you this on the side, but there is a flashlight that you can cut on 
uh, with that button on the side there. It's got a few different modes, which is pretty neat. Uh, but we've run into a point where I wanted to show you guys some different things that you can do with this battery pack. One of the things that's been instrumental in us uh, building the cabin has been a drill. Simply plug that up here on the side. Simply going to take my battery, plug it up. Now, another thing that I want to show you on the side, as I mentioned earlier, you have a few different USB ports. One of the things I'm going to showcase to you guys is charging my Olight Odin. Uh, currently, my weapon light, very, very bright light. Absolutely love this thing. One of the coolest things about this, magnetic. Uh, Dad and I have really enjoyed getting to use this thing. And just to learn how great of a piece of kit it is, uh, it's just been phenomenal. Now, of course, this isn't a you know, 100 watt solar panel. It's meant to be portable. It's meant to be backpack friendly, also car friendly. It's meant to be useful, and that's exactly what it is. This thing is a very useful piece of kit, and I would 110% recommend you buy one and test it out. Again, Dad and I have just, we, we keep talking about how many things that we could charge up with this and just how useful it's going to be uh, out in the field. And again, I've mentioned a few things so far. Again, the obvious, just, just a quick rundown, phones. Obviously, everybody's got a cell phone. Everybody needs to charge their cell phone, which I'd recommend you keep it charged at all times anyway, especially if you're going out into the field. But things happen, uh, and you need to charge it up. This is perfect. Plug it up. Uh, plug the charger up to your solar panel so your battery doesn't get completely depleted. Plug your charger up to your phone. It's that easy. Now, even uh, using the adapters that this kit comes with, you can charge things like a laptop. Just overall, I'm, I'm really impressed with this thing, and it's, it's very useful. And again, I would completely recommend that you get one and test it out. Guys, as always, thank you for watching. Defend the weak and fight for what you love. May the wings of liberty never lose a feather, and God bless.